What's going on guys and welcome back to another video. So in today's video, as the end of the week, I just want to give a brief update on three main topics that I'll be implementing over the next weeks and even months. The first of these will be equipment updates for the channel. The second is trading 212, um, just a brief update on my portfolio and my plans for the next week. And thirdly, I want to talk briefly about my channel goals that I want to implement and I want to work towards for the rest of this year and see can I achieve them by the end of this year also. So first of all, I want to talk briefly about equipment updates. So I went ahead on Saturday and spent over 1500 euro on a new laptop. So I bought the 13.3 inch MacBook Pro. I bought the silver, not the space gray. And one of the main reasons I bought this is that it's going to help drastically improve my editing as I'll be using iMovie uh, on this software so I'm really looking forward to getting my videos edited as such because just for example this video alone there is little in fact there is no editing at all in this video it's just to kind of click start and click finish kind of uh, video so I'm really looking forward to improving drastically over the coming weeks and months uh, the quality of my videos um, so I went ahead and bought that and I'm also currently looking up uh, Ewan Copeland, I'll put his the link to his channel down below, recommended me to get the Canon EOS M6 Mark II. This currently costs about 1100 sterling, so that's about 1200 euro. So he recommended me get this one, this is the one he's using himself, and he, he thinks it's very good, and he highly recommends it. So I feel that I went to my local camera shop uh, yesterday, and they didn't have uh, this model, so I'm going to probably have to buy it online. I might even buy it on Amazon itself here. Um, so once I actually get that, I can start to properly um, kind of edit my videos. And I'll be able to put my face actually in the videos as well, which I feel is very important. Um, as I don't really enjoy watching videos when the person that's speaking isn't actually in the video with themselves. So I'm really looking forward to implementing that also. So... I'm looking to buy this camera over the next few weeks uh, and when I do so you will see a drastic increase in the quality of my videos as I'll be able to, it's 4k resolution and I'll be able to edit them a lot better also so I'm really looking forward to that um, so that will be in the coming weeks as I said so really looking forward to that part of improving the quality of the videos next up is my trading 212 so as you are well aware at this stage, I have three different pies. I have the dividend portfolio, the ETF portfolio, and the growth portfolio. My current value, my overall portfolio, or investment is €2,384.77. Um, later on today, I'm going to the bank and putting in a further €300 Euro into this um, broker, Trailing 2 and 2. And I will be putting €100 Euro into each of these portfolios. Now, the, one of the best reasons people actually use Trading212 is because they use, for example, they go into the, you can put in 100 euro, as such, into my, like just say my growth portfolio. There's currently six slices in this pie. So you put in the 100 euro and it really gets keeps out the headache of having to calculate out yourself because you can buy fractional shares and you can weight it accordingly. So for example, I have this will be split into six to hundred euro, and because I have twenty percent of this particular growth portfolio pie allocated to Amazon, Amazon will get twenty euro into it into this um, investment. So it will obviously be a fractional share. So it really does take the kind of the headache out of actually having to calculate out this yourself. It does it all for you in the auto invest feature. So that definitely makes life a lot easier for investors. So, as I said, I'll be putting the 300 euro in there um, tomorrow. And once the market's open tomorrow on Monday, uh, I'll be implementing that 300 euro. So, it's slowly starting to increase the value of this overall portfolio, which I'm very happy to see. Next up, I want to talk briefly about... Um, I want to talk briefly about the channel goals. So, I have I made out four goals from September to December this year. Uh, the first of these being to get to 1,000 subscribers. Now that might seem an awful lot as we're currently on 236 subscribers. So we're not even quarter of the way to that goal. 
So I'm really looking forward to seeing can we achieve that. And it, the best thing about kind of YouTube as well is that there's kind of a ripple effect. So that kind of multiplies and it's like a snowball effect as such. So I'm looking forward to seeing can we even can we get close to that target or even reach it would be brilliant. Uh, second of all, I want to accumulate 4,000 hours of watch time. We're currently on about 9,700-ish minutes, which um, equivalates to about 160-odd hours. So again, we're only about 4% of the way to that target, but as YouTube has a snowball effect, as I just said, for the subscribers, I do think that it's somewhat manageable, it's somewhat realistic to get to that target, but I'm going to try my very best to get to that anyway. And as I said, once I actually, well, I have the laptop, but once I get the Canon camera also, and start to edit and improve my videos i feel that the subscriber count and watch time will only go on an upward trajectory so i'm really looking forward to seeing how that works out thirdly if i can get step one and two uh, complete i would be really happy if i get this channel monetized before the end of the year the reason being is because i'd be able to improve the quality of my videos and spend a lot more time on them also which would only be of benefit to everyone really so uh, down the line then the long way down the line is that i'd love to be able to give up my nine to five job and do this kind of in a full-time basis along with a few other passive income streams that's the kind of main goal down the line but as i said that's very very far down the line but something i'm definitely willing to work towards and put the work in um and fourthly i want to get my trading 212 portfolio up to five thousand euro overall invested I'm currently on, as we just saw, about 2,400, so another 2,600 needs to be invested before the end of the year. And obviously, uh, a lot of things in life would get in the way of this, such as uh, myself and my girlfriend have been saving for a house the last 18 or so months. So the vast majority of my extra money from uh, my normal job has been going and being pumped into kind of savings accounts for that, um, which is obviously completely normal and I'm very happy to do so. But that's just kind of the reason why I haven't been putting an awful lot into my investing as such because there's definitely more important things coming up in the next year or so that are more important. Um, so I'm really looking forward to kind of getting that up and running also. Um, and obviously not just a house, there's other kind of similar um, similar life kind of events that will be happening as well in the next few years. So that will definitely be taking up a large sum of money, which again is totally fine. I'll just be tipping away at putting in more money into this portfolio as the week so like exact for example i'll be putting in 300 euro tomorrow so it's kind of slow and steady wins the races they say um next up i want to talk or even i want you guys to actually have any recommendations or advice in relation to imovie and editing so as i haven't i haven't used the software before have you any recommendations tips shortcuts um advice as such on the best way i can go about this i've also seen guys um that for example in the videos they have little boxes in the bottom right hand corner of themselves in the videos i'm not quite sure how to actually do that so if any of you which i'm sure you do know how to do um if you could put in the comment section below and how i'll be able to do that also it'd be brilliant if you could help me out there as i feel that once i do get the camera the kind of camera and i also already have the laptop the editing will definitely drastically increase which will obviously drastically increase the quality of the videos so i'm really looking forward to doing that for you guys also as um i'm really looking forward to kind of improving this channel because as i said this video these kind of videos aren't edited at all um it's just kind of start click and start or and click the finish button so i'm really looking forward to actually putting more time into these videos going forward um so just as a recap we went through um, equipment updates on this channel, um, trading 212, I went through what are my plans for that over the coming weeks there, my channel goals also, uh, and I had I just asked for uh, recommendations and advice as well on the iMovie and editing, um, and actually finally just before I go as well, I was thinking of actually changing the name of this channel from Now or Never Finance to my actual name, now when I created the channel first day, uh, I didn't really want to use my own personal name, but as I see this channel is kind of taking off a small bit. Uh, actually, I actually might change it to my real name to kind of more pers put more personalization onto my actual channel. So de um, definitely keep an eye out for that over the coming weeks. And if obviously if I do change it, I will be announcing that 
um, to you guys in advance. So that being said, that brings the end to today's video. Um, it'd be great if you haven't done so already, if you consider subscribing to the channel, smash the like button and comment below, as I said, if you don't mind, with the recommendations and advice in regards to editing going forward. So thanks very much, guys. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. I'll see you guys in the next video.